peace love and light scorpios this message is for you checking to see what's in your energy um for today i believe it is december 6th okay mm -hmm. i'm hearing smooth as butter where is that coming from okay scorpio let's see what's in your energy messages for scorpio spirit nine of pentacles four of wands hmm. okay i'm getting an energy of reaching of course right because you see there's someone some energy reaching now i'm trying to see if this is you reaching or is this someone else reaching i'm getting this is you this is your energy reaching for something there's something that you're reaching for um, may have to do with this four of wands energy energy of community energy of possibly let's adjust this scorpios an energy of coming together of some sort okay you're reaching for higher heights reaching for your goal there may be some there's a goal maybe that you're trying to reach um hmm. and what spirit is really like highlighting right now is how you've got one hand reaching for something and i'm almost getting this energy that there's something else that you're grabbing for while you're reaching for this um okay all right let's see tell me about this nine of pentacles energy i'm hearing something about how long are you gonna keep this up scorpios <laughs> is someone wondering how long you gonna keep this up oh how long are you gonna keep this up <laughs> scorpios okay this is the devil tell me about the nine of pentacles I'm almost getting this like the other hand is really trying to like release yourself from something having to do with this type of energy and and I and the the thing is I heard something about how long are you going to keep this up it's like this energy uh, in the background represented by this card here maybe some folks Mm, some folks, huh? Maybe some folks wondering How long are you going to do it? How long are you going to be able to keep this up? How long are you going to be able to have the stamina to reach for this? Are you going to continue to have the stamina to reach for this? That's the energy I'm getting here Yeah, you're 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 wanting something you're wanting something while someone is possibly wanting you, wanting what you have. Mm. There's a great energy of discipline in you, Scorpios, to where it's almost like whatever it is that you're reaching for, it's almost become like, I want to say it's almost become an obsession. And I know, you know, we don't want to think about the idea of obsession. There's something that you want. It may be material, carnal, mm, sexual, perhaps. Is that you, Scorpios? Whatever it is that this person like whatever it is that this person sees in you it has to do with them perhaps not seeing that thing in them like they see that you have something in you that's like keeping you so focused on your goal to where it's like you've gotten to the point now scorpios where you so clearly see what is ahead of you that there's nothing there's literally nothing in your path like that you're giving attention to and this actually may be concerning 
some folks, they may be concerned that you're not paying attention to them. You have some people that are concerned with this. Mm. Six of Cups. Someone in your past. Mm. Someone that may not have <laughs> a level of maturity. Someone that's that may be connected to you, perhaps a family figure, someone that may not be blood related, someone that you consider family or at some point you did, perhaps. I'm getting that this is your past, so it's not showing up as someone that is like current. Um, how long are you going to keep this up, Scorpios? Tell me more about this devil card. What does the devil want? <laughs> Why is the devil showing up? Clarity. Okay. Hmm. <sighs> okay. So, a couple things are showing up here. Uh, this is the karmic that hasn't learned their lesson, Scorpios. Not yet. Not yet. There's some stuff that's taken place. This is very interesting. Um, hmm. Someone who sees that you have been released from this energy, perhaps that they thought that they were going to bind you into that may actually be looking for you perhaps looking for ways to get to you or perhaps looking for ways to get to something that you have Okay, so Scorpios, there's an energy of releasing yourself from something and being able to reach for something else. It's almost like you're in a position where uh, you are doing for yourself, you are moving. And there's an energy of someone that possibly wanted you to be dependent on them. This is an energy of dependency showing up. Okay. And at this time, like you're in this position of being extremely um, abundant. Uh, and your abundance is coming in so many different uh, forms. You have this like sense of freedom. You have this sense of like being able to just basically take care of take care of business, you know, in your spiritual endeavors. Uh, you have a balanced state of mind. And I'm getting this energy that there's someone that hasn't... I know there's someone that hasn't learned their karmic lesson. There's someone that hasn't learned their lesson. This karmic hasn't learned their lesson, Scorpios. Queen of Pentacles energy. They may see you reaching for this energy at this time and there we go wheel of fortune this is this is some aspect of the past this is some aspect of the past you have the six of cups that showed up which is an aspect of the past you have the wheel of fortune showing an aspect of like you know a past karmic and then this judgment card upside down is that is is someone that apparently 
hasn't learned their lesson and it seems like they are unwilling to learn their lesson ouch <clears throat> i'm getting this energy that this is someone whose life currently is not really oh the exact words is their life is in shambles someone someone is wondering there's someone that's after something oh okay this is possibly libra gemini aquarius energy um that's at a state of desperation they're becoming desperate scorpios you i'm pretty sure some of you are like what do i care <laughs> at this point because you're in this energy of literally being so focused and reaching for the goals and the uh you know the things that you see for yourself many of you are really not even concerned about this person so um i'm not sure why they're showing up in your energy at this time let me see if i get can get some more information um about this nine of pentacles tell us about the nine of pentacles okay so you have I'm not sure if it came upside down but the first thing that i saw i saw the word greed and i saw the word perseverance there's someone who's who's got some obsession who's got some obsession with something that you have and i'm hearing this uh i'm hearing that uh your intuition is 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 revealing or is letting you know exactly who it is there's someone that has an obsession with what you have there's something that you have perhaps that's bringing you into this independent uh wealth energy and i'm getting like <laughs> this person is really like they haven't learned their lesson scorpios they haven't learned their lesson mm-hmm someone hasn't learned their lesson something about an intuition something about uh perhaps someone in that may think that they have some kind of like spiritual you know leg up on you or you know something like that they think they have a spiritual leg up perhaps they've been doing some studying they've been looking at things and ways to you know amp up uh i'm hearing that they didn't know that you'd be this powerful they didn't know that um this karmic that hasn't learned their lesson scorpios they didn't know that you'd be this powerful spiritually and they have come to realize and many of them you get to know that your spiritual team already warned them not to yet they haven't learned their lesson and i'm hearing that they didn't know that you'd be this powerful spiritually and they're it's like they still want something that you have okay and they're persevering they're 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 it's like it's like this annoying bird that's pecking at something right here right <clears throat> typically this bird would represent in some aspects i'm hearing that it does represent like some spiritual guardian that's guarding over what you have in another sense i'm also seeing that this may represent like this annoying karmic that has not learned their lesson yet they're unwilling to learn their lesson scorpios and now that they've uncovered that there's a lot more opportunities there's good news there's more coming towards you i'm seeing scorpios like this person is seeing the increase that you have like you have more opportunities they want what you have they want what you have scorpios they want what you have part of what you have is this like spiritual maturity this you know you're a spiritual boss in tune with divine knowledge in tune with esoteric knowledge 
there's a lot that you have that they want there's a lot that you have scorpios that they actually want and i'm getting that it's someone in your past this is someone that's in your past that want what you have they want what you have this energy of like mm, obsession this is what what they see in you this is what the power that they see in you this is what they're obsessed about initially it may have been some kind of material thing because i'm getting this energy that this person may not have known exactly how powerful you were because they were not fighting you on the spiritual level quite yet or perhaps they were and they were not coming to you as strong they may have been going after your stability something that you had that they wanted right and this karmic is unwilling to learn their lesson It's become an obsession at this point, Scorpios. It's become an obsession at this point. They haven't learned their lesson yet. Yeah, you wonder, you may have been wondering what happened to that karmic, them karmics. They haven't learned their lesson. They're unwilling to learn the lesson. Tell us more about this uh, Nine of Pentacles. I'm getting that this person is they may be waiting for the opportunity creating the opportunity there's someone that's like really um someone is not seeing clearly someone who's obviously not seeing clearly this uh libra gemini aquarius that may want to like charge in with this energy because they love a challenge i'm here they love a challenge and boy do you have a chat and boy do you have a challenge for them mm -hmm. they love a challenge and boy do you have a challenge for them you are a challenge for them this is what they're going to be met with for sure whatever it is that they're coming with again seven of swords energy deceit you know this is obviously someone that hasn't learned their lesson because they've tried this already. This sneaky, selfish, like greedy behavior, they've tried this already. And they are trying to come in and charge in at this point because they've had enough time to sit at the crossroads and think. And what they're thinking is Scorpio. How long are you going to be able to keep this up? How long are you going to be able to, to keep this from me? Like it's yours. <laughs> Go and sit down somewhere. Tell us more about this Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, it's like this person has had some time to be in their feelings. This person that has, has had some time to be in their feelings. Like, Scorpios, this is the kind of person where it's like... Like karma has dealt them some stuff, right? And they had plenty of time to sit under that tree and make things right. And instead of really thinking, oh, look at what they did to bring themselves in this situation. They'd rather think, oh, look at what Scorpio is doing. Look at the challenge that they're presenting. Scorpio is wanting a war. Look at look at how Scorpio is behaving. And this is the same person that started this war. This is the same person that started this war that is now trying to charge towards you because they love a challenge. And 
most importantly Scorpios what you get to know is this is a karmic that refuses to learn a lesson they refuse to see the part that they play in their like shitty life like things are really going downhill for this person look at this this is this is what the energy is showing up for them right they refuse to learn their lesson judgment card upside down they're in this energy of foolishness fool card upside down like they're having poor judgment they're naive a lot lack of experience a lot of um energy of naivety star card upside down it's like this person is blinded they're they lack the ab ability to reason to really see what is the truth and therefore they're not able to heal and move forward and it's like why are you wondering how long is scorpio going to be able to keep this up you're a challenge for them this is some sick twisted really twisted person really sick twisted person that is not changing at this time yep Instead of finding the mental strength necessary to overcome this, they'd rather be content in their cesspool of bullcrap. Hmm. They're experiencing a lot of hardship at this time, Scorpios. Right? And the and the funny thing is, they think it may have something to do with you. They, they think that you're the cause of this when it's like... You started this war. What are you talking about? And it's my fault that you're losing. And it's my fault that karma is biting you in the ass. But you can't see it. You know. You were given an opportunity to sit under that tree. Get some breeze. And really think about the ish that you did. And you refuse. They ref you refuse to do what? What they refuse to do, Scorpios? Let go of the past. This karmic refuses to let go of the past. And I see this keeps coming up. They want success. They want to, to succeed at this. This is an energy of home. So this may actually have something to do with your home. And I'm hearing something about chickens coming home to roost. Whatever it is that means that may be something significant to some of y'all. It's, it's interesting because this is an energy of letting go of the past. And this is giving this energy of someone, you know, that wants to. <sighs> bring something back. <laughs> they think that you're a challenge, Scorpios. And that's the sick, twisted thing that's like even like keeping them. Mm. Scorpios. All right. Anything else you want us to know, Spirit? Okay. So. So the Divine is saying if they want to fight Scorpios. They're really fighting themselves first and foremost. <laughs> this fight that they actually want with you, Scorpios. It's really just, they're willing to fight with you just to get your attention. They're willing to like keep this up just to get your attention. This is some kind of like sick, you know, twisted type of way of thinking. And the divine is saying that they're not going to be fighting you, Scorpios. The divine is saying that 5-5, five, 10-10. Five, <laughs> ten, ten. If you know, you know, you gonna be fighting your own shadow. Yep. You gonna keep chasing your tail. You gonna keep repeating the same thing until you learn that mistake. And in the meantime, the attention that you're trying to get from Scorpio, it's not happening. You're in a state of delusion. Okay. Anything else?
Scorpio, who is this? Who is this? You know who it is. Mm. Yep. Person is in a state of illusion. And here you are showing up, Scorpios, in your own reading. Because this person is going to be repeating the same. Ooh, you're going to be the greatest lesson and the greatest defeat that they've ever known. Mm. Mm -mm. You are going to be the greatest lesson and the greatest defeat they have ever known, Scorpios. And that is the word of the divine. I am led to leave the message from there. Nine, nine. That's the end. You are the greatest lesson and the greatest defeat that they've ever known. Yep. That's that. That's the last word. That's the last word. Mm. Abuela Medicina saying something. Change. Message regarding this reading, Scorpios. Abuela Medicina was meant to come out. And I see Panthera is also showing up regarding your strength. Okay, Abuela Medicina. Ooh. All these energies, Scorpios, this is fierce. This is your ancestors, and this is that energy of you with the with energy of resilience, the lion, the panther. Like, I don't know who this person think they fooling. It ain't you. Okay. That's what it is. You are the greatest. You are going to be the greatest lesson and the greatest defeat. Something like that. Let's see. <clears throat> Panthera, precious and rare, and rare. You have the strength to handle any challenge, even the ones that intimidate you. You may feel that you are alone in the fight sometimes, but there are forces of good in spirit and upon the earth that are fighting with you, supporting you, believing in you, assisting in you, assisting you and championing your success. It may not always feel like it, but you are not in this alone. There is help at hand to uncover a hidden piece of information which will allow truth and justice to prevail. Truth and justice. Truth and justice. That's it. 22. If you, if you doubt it, the Panthera energy is letting you know you are going to be the greatest lesson and the greatest defeat that they have ever experienced will be through you. This oracle indicates awakening and the healing and strengthening of divine masculine energy within the soul for taking the initiative um, and leading with wisdom. Healing masculinity is relevant at both physical and psychological levels. To love and make peace with the masculine allows it to become dynamic and expressive of integrity, purpose, justice, and protection. Um, so you may actually be dealing with some masculine that's not really in their like uh, divinity, you know, energy. Uh, take it as it resonates. Some of you, it's not a masculine. It may actually relate to a sign. Perhaps it's a fire sign, Leo, Sag, Aries energy that's needing to, you know awaken because there's there's still some aspects of them that are asleep and they refuse to awaken abuela medicina is saying you are on a healing journey put your trust in the genius of spirit and the medicine of the earth through which divine healing can express itself as you allow your spiritual connection to guide your earthly steps with synchronicity and divine intervention you will be supported through a healing journey that will be profound for you the oracle indicates a healing outcome that will enhance your soul journey. Your soul has healing gifts and you are meant to fully participate in an exploration of healing. Mm. So that is the word of the divine. Like, Know that this, this lesson that this karmic for some reason hasn't learned, it has to do with their healing. And the fact that the divine is saying that you are going to be the greatest lesson, the greatest lesson 
that they're going to learn is through you, it means that their healing is going to happen because of you too, Scorpios. You are this great healer. And the transformative power that you exude, it heals even the karmics that refuse, that are unwilling to learn their lesson. And so the divine is saying, yes, you are that person that the greatest lesson and the greatest defeat they're going to experience the greatest defeat they're going to experience is going to be the greatest lesson that they learn it's going to be through you and that's the word of the divine if this message resonates please like comment share and subscribe until next time love peace and divine light